making sure that you're seated comfortably, making sure that your head is above your chest, and your chest is above your belly, your belly is above your pelvis. As usual, we're going to start the practice by simply shifting from unconsciousness of breathing to consciousness of breathing, or as it's often called, awareness of breathing. This is a profound shift of attention, the capacity, the ability to sustain attention on breath. The shift itself is important. The capacity to sustain attention is powerful. From the evidence we currently have available, this attentional shift changes the very structure and therefore function of the brain. Attention molds the brain. Where we choose to place our attention and how we sustain attention builds neural pathways within the brain. This shift into awareness of breathing is profound. In the beginning, it's really difficult to sustain. Such a hard thing to do. As you become more skilled, more adept, you can sustain your attention on breath for longer and longer periods of time. Until such times it's possible to be attentive to the breath for the whole of the day, from when you wake up until when you go to sleep. So for this session, we're just doing it for a very short period of time. Now, I believe it's powerful to do it for five-minute periods to begin with. And then repeat a few times a day, as often as you can. And then gradually build up your practice until it's 10 minutes or 15 minutes. And then before you know it, you'll be in a state of ease, delight, and deep presence with the breath for an hour. This practice is the core practice of many meditational styles. Now shift to intentional breathing. We're going to shift to another part of the brain now. So rather than just watching the breath, we're going to stay in attention. But what we're also doing now is coming into voluntary control of the breath. So I want you to initially be aware of your tongue, place it behind the top teeth, just at the roof of the mouth, just behind the roots of the teeth. And place it gently there. Spread the lips softly, a little bit of space between the lips, so the jaw and the muscles of the face relax, the fascial muscles, the, the web of tissues around the temporalis and the masseter muscle, the muscles around the eyes can all soften and relax. Now 
placing just the right amount of contact on the tongue, tongue tip. Spread the nostrils as you breathe in. And as you breathe in through the nostrils, feel the direct consequence of that and expand the diaphragm. Expand the belly. That expansion of the belly is the diaphragm pressing down. And then relax on the exhale. Simple, relaxed elasticity of the abdominal muscles and the diaphragm elastically recoiling on the exhale. And in the inhale, the diaphragm pushes down again. And you feel the consequences of that in terms of the belly expanding. So feel each inhale here as the breath enters through the nostrils, you're spreading the nostrils. And you're opening the belly in response to that diaphragmatic pressure pushing down onto the intestines. You're letting the belly relax. Now, for most of us, this is going to be around about a five to six second inhale when we're relaxed, when we're sitting in a relaxed position. And if we're not overstressed, overadrenalized, living uh, in trauma, then the breath is going to be about five to six seconds on the inhale, quite naturally. And the elasticity of the exhale is going to be five to six seconds. So every breath takes about 12 seconds. And if you feel into the abdominal area, you can perhaps feel the breath, not just expanding the front of the body, but the back of the body as well. So if you keep your tailbone very softly tucked on the inhale, you can feel this diaphragm pressing down to the back part of the body around the um, quadratus lumborum muscles. And it can actually help this feeling if you very softly tuck the tail on the inhale. And relax very softly. We're talking about a micro movement in the, in the sacrum. So the tailbone tucks down gently. The tail tucks down gently on the inhale. And releases on the exhale. So this is enabling a 360 degree experience of the breath, the back, the sides and the front of the belly all opening in response to the downward pressure of the diaphragm. And there might be a natural pause at the end of the inhale, the second or two, in which case allow this. So we've got this five, six second inhale. A natural pause at the peak of the inhale, which is that 360 degree abdominal expansion. And then the relaxation on the exhale, which again is going to be about five to six seconds. There might be a micro pause at the end of the exhale of half a second or a second. Allow these natural pauses to occur. So each of these breaths now become about 15 seconds. That's four breaths a minute.
if you spend some time each day, I recommend at least three times a day, just breathing in this way, you're resetting your biological default to a place of relaxation, ease, effortlessness, peace. Spread the nostrils. As you spread the nostrils, it slows the air down. You span the nostrils. That itself is affecting the limbic system. All the organs in the belly are softly riding the wave of the breath, being surreptitiously massaged into a state of peace. Peristaltic flow of the intestines. is relaxing into a similar rhythm. The heart is speeding up on the inhale and slowing down on the exhale, matching the rhythm of the breath in its pulsing. And as it's doing so, the electromagnetic pulse of the heart through the body is rhythmically Massaging the whole electromagnetic web of this livingness, this beingness that you are. Cerebrospinal fluid in the brain is synchronizing. with this breath rhythm. And this incredibly harmonic, resonant, coherent breath, when you practice it three times or so a day, becomes a place that you come home to the natural ease and relaxation of what it is to be alive. Modern contemporary lifestyle is rippling with stresses, demand. When we return our system to its innate setting of ease on a daily basis, we have a place from which to begin to de-stress, to down-regulate, to make life easy again. <laughs>